All right, cool. Um, so, welcome to my second video. I'm wearing a blue tank top of today. Um, I'm wearing a blue navy tank top for this one. Um, this is another favorite of mine, Al Purdy, Necropsy of Love. Um, necropsy is an old term for autopsy. Um, just so you know what that is, because I didn't know what it was until I googled it the very first time. Um, this is also off Caribou Horses. Um, one of Purdy's few love poems, um, I guess about his his wife, about Eurith. Um, I I've read his poems, mo pretty much all of them, the, all the good ones, anyways. You know, he wrote thousands before he was published that were bad. Um, and he didn't seem to write a whole lot of love poems or about Yurith a whole lot. So, but the few he did write, which is this one, he wrote about Yurith's sister, Norma. It's interesting. But this poem is very lovely. Very, very lovely. And referenced in the song... Um, which I'll pull up just to show you guys. So, um, yeah, I'm going to read it, put in the YouTube, same deal as before. And I'll hold the mic, like, around here. Check, check, check. Because over here was too close. I'm going to go like this. Because um, I noticed the first half was, like, clipping, so I'm going to go, like, here. And, yeah, let's just uh, get into it. And this one's pretty short, so don't worry. Well, I mean, if you're going to watch this anyway, you're probably watching the whole thing. I can't imagine this is something like, oh, let me... <laughs> like, if you're either not going to watch this or you're going to watch it, you know? Which is like 10% of whoever's seeing this in their feed is like going to click on it and watch the whole thing. Um, anyways, anyway, I keep saying anyways, but it's not correct. Necropsy of Love, 1965. If it came about you died, it might be said I loved you. Love is an absolute as death is and neither bears false witness to the other, but you remain alive. No, I do not love you. Hate the word. That private tyranny inside a public sound. Your freedom's yours and not my own, but hold my separate madness like a sword and plunge it in your body all night long. If death shall strip our bones of all but bones, then here's the flesh, and flesh that's drunk and sweet as wine cups in deceptive lunar light. Reach up, reach up your hand and turn the moonlight off, and maybe it was never there at all. So never promise anything to me but reach across the darkness with your hand. Reach across the darkness of tonight and touch the moving moment once again before you fall asleep. Al Purdy. So, just a very pretty, and refreshing love poem. Um, Especially the line, no, I do not love you. Like, this word that's become, like, a public sound. People say it all the time. Um, in the tyranny of love, I guess, it is he's trying to argue. Saying, like, your freedom is yours, and it's not my own. Um, but still, like, hold my madness, the whatever I am feeling, this love. And, you know, fuck, let's fuck, is what he's saying. Plunge it in your body all night long. I mean... You know, saying it in, in nicer words. Um,
Yeah, and just touch the moving moment once again. It's just, yeah, very nice imagery. Um, really love this poem. And because it's, it's, it's a more nuanced love poem, you know, because Al and Yurith's relationship, which is Al's wife, is very rocky at the best of times. Uh, you know, they were back and forth with each other. Not, well, but it was, it was a tough relationship, but they stayed married for 60 plus years, something like that. Really incredible. Um, both of them, and I think Al's th the kind of guy that it's hard for him to express that, maybe in person, but through his art, his writing, that can his love can show through his real feelings. Um, and then just to show, uh, the East Wind by Gord Downey, great album. Um, three contributors on here. I guess it's all that guy. Um, no, I do not love you, hate the word, that private tyranny inside a public sound. I guess I could, like, add, I have a genius account, I could add things on here, I don't really care that much. Um, this thing has had one viewer since who knows when. Um, and then this is from, um, another book um, which I forget he mentions it in an interview but this is you know obviously pretty um, the line we just read here no I do not love you hate the word private inside public sound but yeah so he read pretty and he references him more um, than I think some people know don't look at that. Oh, don't look at that. Um, yeah, so that's the poem. I'll put in the description. Really nice love poem. That's pretty much all I have to say. Um, making one more of these videos today, but I'm gonna just upload them all today because um, I'm not gonna have the motivation otherwise. And I have it now, so. See you in the next one.